to another celebration. This time, it's the 30th anniversary of the Levantese Foundation Nigeria. It was established in 1988 to support the federal government's educational program with emphasis on self-sufficiency in food production. Some winners were also awarded at the gala night. Take a look. Government officials and diplomats joined the Levantese Foundation Nigeria to celebrate its 30th anniversary with this gala night. It was a time for the foundation to celebrate three decades of impacting lives by attracting the youth into agriculture, as well as training and supporting them in achieving improved, eco-friendly and technologically developed farming practices. It gives me great pleasure to welcome you all to this gala dinner in celebration of the 30th anniversary of Levantis Foundation Nigeria. For Levantis Foundation, it's been 30 years of service to community development and building capacity in the agricultural sector. The celebration could not have come at a better time than now, considering that it coincides with a period when the country is witnessing significant interest in the agricultural sector. Over these years, we have seen graduates from our agricultural training schools move on to establish themselves in competitive agribusiness ventures. The world witnessed the gathering of leaders and innovators who are working to meet the sustainable development goals and making a difference in their own respective ways. This year's Goalkeepers event is aimed at celebrating progress made towards fighting global inequality and ending world poverty. Tonight, we are gathered to do about the same, to celebrate the achievements of the three decades of intervention by the Leventis Foundation and support to projects across the world and in various sectors and parts of Nigeria, particularly in the agricultural sector. I am delighted to welcome you all to this gala dinner. The theme for the 30th anniversary celebration is three decades of service and enhanced livelihood. This theme reflects the Ventus Foundation's commitment to societal development and livelihood improvement. <laughs> Then, the dignitaries joined the management team to cut the celebration cake. Let's go! Three decades of service and enhanced livelihoods. Can we please give a resounding round of applause for the Levantist Foundation of Nigeria? Thank you very much for the work you are doing. We appreciate you. Our chairman executive governor of Kerry State, Alhaji Atiku Baburu, and the remaining dignitaries will now go take their seats.
The foundation partnered with several state governments and the Gala Night afforded them the opportunity to appreciate these partners. Three budding agriculture entrepreneurs were rewarded by the foundation after they were picked for having the best business ideas. And egg production. Now we need this money to expand the business. This business plan was so attractive. I would advise that youth should look at the broader perspective and see that agriculture is wide. It doesn't just limit you to being on the farm every day and staying under the sun. You could be a clean farmer, do a greenhouse, learn other aspects of agriculture, or you could just be one who adds value to the agricultural produce, go to the um, farms, buy these things that the farmers farm, and change them into things that can be used by the end user at home. Leventy's foundation was set up following the philanthropic legacy of late Chief Judge Anastasio Leventy's to assist educational, cultural and other charitable courses in West Africa, with Nigeria as a major beneficiary. As they celebrate 30 successful years of impacting lives around the world, we wish them all the best. We say congratulations to all those who were awarded. 